Oh yeah, new wheel day. Check those out. Those are sick. Let's head outside so we can get some better lighting so we can actually get a look at these things. All right, so now that you've seen the wheels, let's go mount these things with some tires. So my goal is gonna be able to try to set these up while at home, no compressor, and let's see how it works out. some soapy water, see if that'll help kind of get this thing seated. Okay, so I've just figured out that Boyd Cycling Wheels is probably the easiest wheel I've ever had to seat. Um, yeah, that was pretty easy. Hopefully I don't jinx myself for the next one. But yeah, so that's a trick that I learned um, from Schwalbe actually is uh, use soapy water because it causes that slip to kind of seat into the rim. And I don't know if it's because Boyd has these hookless rims that you know the tires just seat, tend to slide and seat a lot easier, but that was actually super easy. I think I jinxed myself. You can see me sweating, trying to get that tire on. But, it'll probably be super easy to see. I don't know, we'll see. It's also like 90 degrees out here. Just like that, now we just gotta put sealing in them. So yeah, I like to use these small uh, two ounce bottles of stands and I put about two ounces per tire uh, of sealing in there and yeah, this is just kind of the easiest method I've found. Buy a big bottle of stands and fill them up and then remove the valve core and fill her up. So yeah, you could probably go to your local bike shop and ask them for a valve core remover and you should have something like this. They might just give it to you. Boom, easy as that. So I thought about it and I don't want my wife to kill me so I'm gonna move over here and try to get some sealing in these tires. little mess but could have been a lot worse so now we're gonna pump this thing back up and it should be ready to go but yeah just like that we have now set up tubeless rims at home with Boyd cycling Schwalbe tires Silka and I guess stands no tubes <laughs> 